Vladimir Putin. Vladimir Putin. Vladimir Putin. Vladimir Putin. They say if we don't learn from history, then we're doomed to repeat it. Surely Putin has read up on how Germany ended up crippled after World War II, right? Then why does he seem to be making the same mistakes Hitler did? Putin does seem to be heading down the same path that Hitler took, claiming to defend their isolated people in foreign states. Hitler did it in 1938 to Czechoslovakia, and Putin is using the same excuse in 2022. Hitler inherited a broken Germany, and it was a shell of its former glory. Hitler wanted to protect his people and decided that the Germans living in Sudetenland, a slice of Czechoslovakia bordering Germany, needed protection. It justified his reasoning to invade. Was Putin's Crimea the same as Hitler's Sudetenland? Taking these smaller areas made it easier to take the entire country later. While the beginning of their invasions has a similar ring to them, will Putin's invasion also lead to economic ruin like Hitler's ultimately did? When Hitler started invading Eastern Europe, he began stirring up the Western powers. Not only would it become a war of bombs and bullets, but a production race. Germany had spread itself thin over battling several fronts and couldn't sustain the war machine they had initially started. As a result, their trade partners diminished. There were little to no investments being made back into their civilian economy. Their conquered territories were so severely damaged that their production was below predicted levels. So, how is Putin headed down the same road? First off, Russia is currently being hit with some of the hardest sanctions ever imposed on a country. Their trade and banking with the West will come to a halt, and their economy is in a weakened condition, similar to Germany's. Putin has awakened the Western powers again, and if he continues his aggressive advances on bordering countries, he will have to pump more money into his military spending. It doesn't seem like the Russian economy could sustain that kind of spending, especially as they fight alone. Russia is on a slippery slope with their Ukrainian invasion. Their justification for preserving their people and stopping the encroachment of NATO and Western expansion with war may be the very thing that destroys their own economy. Защищают Россию в ходе специальной военной операции. Понимаю, как вы переживаете за своих любимых и близких. Вы можете гордиться ими так же, как вместе с вами ими гордится и переживает за них вся страна. If you liked this video, then please give us a like and subscribe for more interesting videos. What else do you want us to talk about? Leave us a comment about what you want to see in the next video from Kinda Viral.